The Salvation Army's annual luncheon is an opportunity for donors and supporters to come together to learn more about the Salvation Army's mission, purpose, and impact on the community. Today, the organization celebrates its 10th luncheon, which brought together 400 people. Here's more. People from all around Brazos County are celebrating the Salvation Army's 10th annual Doing the Most Good Luncheon, which is not only a time to remember what the organization has done so far, but also a time to look to the future the organization is heading towards. Lieutenant Timothy Israel, executive director and core officer for the Salvation Army of Brazos Valley, says the organization is extremely thankful for all the support it gets each year and says it makes what they do in the community possible. We've especially seen that in this last year as we've seen an unprecedented amount of need and yet every time the community stepped up and met that need and that challenge and so we just thank them for that and thank them for supporting the Salvation Army and allowing us to be the vehicle through which they give and support those in need in our community. The luncheon also included a live auction where all proceeds stay right here in Brazos County to help the Salvation Army help the community. The highest bid of the day was on the ultimate Aggie football experience. Four tickets to any 2021 Aggie football game plus other little perks donated by Corps Commandant Brigadier General Joe Ramirez, which went home with Richard Bauer, a participant in the Salvation Army. Of course, it was, it was a little expensive, and, but it was very rewarding knowing that what it's going to go to is going to be a fulfillment of really God's mission here on earth. Lieutenant Israel says the donations they received today from the live auction will help so many people with so many different problems. That's really what we see when we see the dollars coming in. It's just the service we're going to be able to have and the impact we're going to be able to have in our community. Bauer says the luncheons take a full year to plan out, but... It's very rewarding. Of course, it's really the good Lord's mission that one should have uh, that in their heart, is meeting the needs of, of other people that are distressed and distraught. And a big thank you from KAGS to the Salvation Army for inviting us to this special occasion today and gifting us with this beautiful plaque. Now, if you didn't attend the luncheon but want to help out, go to our website, click on this story, and you'll find the link so you can make a donation online right now.